Lesson 112 in A Course in Miracles, starting with reciting a portion of the review to help you remember how to do it. Devote five minutes twice a day or longer if you would prefer to contemplating the ideas assigned. Read over the ideas and comments which are written down for each day's exercises. Then begin to think about them quietly letting your mind relate them to your needs, your seeming problems, and all your concerns. Place the ideas within your mind and let it use them as it chooses. Give it faith that it will use them wisely, being helped in its decisions by the one who gave the thoughts to you. What can you trust but what is in your mind? Have faith in these reviews. The means the Holy Spirit uses will not fail. The wisdom of your mind will come to your assistance. Give it direction at the start and then lean back in quiet faith and let it use the ideas you have given it as they were given you. You have been given them in perfect trust, in perfect confidence, that you would use them well, in perfect faith, that you would understand their messages and use them for yourself. Offer them to your mind in that same trust and confidence and faith it will not fail. It is the Holy Spirit's chosen means for your salvation, and with his trust it merits yours as well. So you're actively giving over your problems, your needs, your concerns, anything that arises. You're letting your mind come up with the answer. Maybe it will respond with the idea of the day or something similar. So any temptation in your mind of anything that's not less than peaceful let the ideas dispel all negativity, all doubt, all fear and pain. Trusting in your mind's inherent wisdom, you need not try to do anything. You're just allowing your mind, the mind of God, to relate these ideas and dispel them. If your mind becomes blank, focus either on the idea or the felt state of the idea. You may even want to voice the idea. I have a problem with so-and-so, I feel sad about so-and-so. And then your mind may come up with the answer, I am invulnerable, I am light, I am peace, I am joy, or using the idea for the day. This is beginning practice, lesson 93. Light and joy and peace abide in me. Light and joy and peace abide in me. I am the home of light and joy and peace. I welcome them into the home I share with God because I am part of Him. And lesson 94, I am as God created me. I am as God created me. I will remain forever as I was, created by the changeless like himself. And I am one with him and he with me. I will remain forever as I was, created by the changeless like himself, and I am one with him and he with me.
light and joy and peace abide in me. I am the home of light and joy and peace. I welcome them into the home I share with God because I am part of him. I am as God created me. I will remain forever as I was, created by the changeless like himself. And I am one with him and he with me. practice to do on the hour, light and joy and peace abide in me. On the half hour, I am as God created me. We understand, of course, that it may be impossible for you to undertake what is suggested here as optimal each day and every hour of the day. Learning will not be hampered when you miss a practice period because it is impossible at the appointed time. Nor is it necessary that you make excessive efforts to be sure that you can catch up in terms of numbers. Rituals are not our aim and would defeat our learning goal. But learning will be hampered when you skip a practice period because you are unwilling to devote the time to it that you are asked to give. Do not deceive yourself in this. Unwillingness can be most carefully concealed behind a cloak of situations you cannot control. Learn to distinguish situations which are poorly suited to your practicing from those which you establish to uphold the camouflage of your unwillingness. Those practice periods which you have lost because you did not want to do them for whatever reason should be done as soon as you have changed your mind about your goal. You are unwilling to cooperate in practicing salvation only if it interferes with gods you hold more dear. When you withdraw the value given them, allow your practice periods to be replacements for your litanies to them. They gave you nothing, but your practice periods offer you everything. Accept their offering and be at peace. The format you should use for these reviews is this. 